how do you get your memory back? And uh, when you have paralysis and you have numbness still, how does, how, is there anything you can take for that? Well, the good news is that people can now grow new brain cells. I grew up in an era from Harvard Medical School to high school biology where they said you couldn't grow new brain cells. We now know that you can grow them, you can repair them, that there are ways of removing what's called numbness or neuropathy through nutrients and diet of all types, and there are drugs that can do it. Some are natural, like Neurontin, some are conventional, like Cymbalta. They can remove pain. There are stroke patients that I have seen that have thrown their cane away and have come back you know, with various programs, and others that I've seen that were in a wheelchair that I wondered why I was even trying. The next thing I know, they're in braces walking around. So you can recover from stroke, and the brain has much more renewable power than has ever been documented hitherto. Okay. And how do you do that? Well, there are hormones, there are medications, strong medications, there are dietary techniques, there are exercises for the brain, and it depends. Each person's stroke is different. On the MRI, you can see what region was down. And you damaged. can renew the brain, renew you the cells, renew, renew the yeah. health of it. You can renew wow. dead cells. There's hidden parts of the brain, even though it looks dead, it's not quite dead. It's, in fact, we've seen this in comatose. I've been asked to tell whether or not a person can come back from a coma or not. And there are ways to tell whether or not a brain still has life or the person's been dead for 15 years. It's amazing.